Muslim students at Rutgers University say they don't feel safe after an Islamic center was broken into and vandalized. CBS 2's Christine Sloan live in New Brunswick with more. Christine. Chris, Muslim students and leaders here on campus say they want better protection. And they're calling what happened inside this building a center for Muslim students and active hate during the Islamic celebration of Eid. Muslim students say as they celebrated the end of Ramadan, they found a mess inside the Center for Islamic Life on Rutgers campus in New Brunswick. A Palestinian flag, the chaplain here says, ripped off its pole. In addition, students say art pieces with verses from the Quran were destroyed. Police say the break in they're investigating happened at 4 30 Wednesday morning and that the windows were shattered and a television set and printer were also broken. The governor and attorney general as well and other officials releasing statements saying they are disgusted by the news. Rutgers University president calling the alleged vandalism quote a criminal act of bias and hatred. Muslim students holding the press conference here moments ago say it's not a coincidence this happened on Eid. They say they do not feel safe on campus. Muslim students no longer feel truly safe to even exist at Rutgers. This incident has been deeply saddening, yet unfortunately not surprising. Islamophobia has been plaguing our campus, manifesting in verbal harassment of students, physical acts of hate, and Islamophobic threats left on personal property and vehicles. A Muslim leader here tells us that police are looking through surveillance video, possibly inside and definitely outside to see if they can have any clues as to what happened here. The attorney general's office releasing very little details about what happened inside this building. Of course, we'll have more for you coming up later on today. Live in New Brunswick, New Jersey, Christine Sloan, CBS 2 News. Christine, thank you.